everybody, and welcome back to another episode of HGTV Live. I am Jack Bozma. And I am Elliot Hartford. We would like to send our sincerest apologize to you viewers that we did not have a video up last week, but as you know, the power went out in Hitchcock and Tulare. Well, the power didn't go out, but the heaters yes, went out. Yeah. So we didn't have school on Thursday, so that's why we are doing last week's stuff this week. And so, yeah. That's how it's going. Mm -hmm. um, so now we will send it to Briar with kids in the elementary. You, Derek. I'm Briar Close for HGTV Live. I'm here with... The one and only Neil Salmon. Neil, how are you doing? Good. Good? What grade are you in? Fifth grade. Fifth grade? That's nice. Um, how's school been going then? Good. Good? What's your favorite subject? Or the favorite, anything special going on in school? No, but math is my favorite subject. Okay. Um, so last week we were asking, what is your favorite animal? Probably a crocodile. Crocodile. That sounds nice. Thank you. You're welcome. And now I'm here with... Justin Purcell. Justin, what grade are you in? Fifth. Fifth grade? Okay. How's school been going? Good. Good? That's good. Do you got any favorite subjects? That's... Art and science. Okay. So then what is your favorite animal then? A rabbit. A rabbit? That sounds cool. And now I'm here with... Blaine a puffer. Blaine, what grade are you in? I'm in sixth grade. Sixth grade? Okay. How's school been going? Good. Good? good? That's good. Yeah. What's your favorite subject? Uh, probably reading. Reading? That's good. So, last couple questions we've asked is, what is your favorite animal? Uh, a giraffe. Giraffe, that sounds cool. And back to the desk. Thank you, Mayor, for those lovely interviews. Uh, always good to see you going over there and doing all that fun stuff. So, we'll send it to uh, Jacob for weather. Hey, it's the weather, man. For your seven-day forecast in the Hitchcock Tulare area this week, uh, for Friday, we have a high of 68, low of 61. Saturday is a high of 66, low of 36. Sunday is a high of 42, low of 25. Monday is a high of 42, low of 20. And Tuesday is a high of 52, low of 37. And Wednesday is a high of 65, low of 38. And Thursday is a high of 62, low of 43. Back to you. Um, thank you, Jacob, for that weather update. It's supposed to kind of turn around a little bit, knock on wood. Hopefully it starts feeling like spring here pretty quick. Yep. Yeah. Um, uh, and now we will send it to Zach with sports. Now I'm here with the sports update. Uh, the track team went to Redfield yesterday for the Redfield relays, and I have uh, placement placings for that. So for the boys' 300-meter hurdles, TJ Salmon got first. In the 110-meter hurdles, TJ Salmon got second. Uh, for triple jump in the girls, Caitlin Schrader got third. Um, boys high jump, Jack Boomsma got sixth. And um, boys long jump, Jack got seventh. In uh, the boys four by 100 relay, they got sixth with a team consisting of Kyle, Jack, Landon, and TJ. In, in the four by two, they also got sixth with a team consisting of Kyle, Landon, TJ, and Eric. Um, the 4x100 girls got eighth, and Eric Salmon placed eighth in discus, and the medley team also placed eighth. Thank you. Thank you, Zach, for those lovely, lovely, lovely sports updates. Uh, we'll send it to Senior Spotlight. To you. And now I'm here with Jack Boomsma. Jack, what's your plans after high school? <laughs> um, uh, I plan on attending uh, Western Welling Academy in Gillette, Wyoming. Okay. Uh, you have any uh, scholarships you plan on uh, uh, applying for, or can you? Um, I'm uncertain right now if I can apply for any, but I'm going to look into it, and if I can, then I'll definitely apply for some. Okay, that's a good idea. You best look into that. Um. What's your dream job, Jack? Um, well, obviously, I want to, well, oh, I'm going to weld on the pipeline for a couple of years, but after that, I want to come back and farm with Dad. 
living the life. Um, where do you see yourself in five years? Hopefully, while I'm not a pipeline somewhere. Hopefully. Hopefully. Uh, what's your favorite high school memory? Um, probably State FFA uh, freshman year when uh, you threw Elliot in the pool and he wrecked his knee and you had to take him to Mr. Brink. That was not a fun conversation to have. Uh, well, we've run out of time, and uh, thank you, Jack, and good luck. Thank you. Thank you for the senior spotlights, whoever did. Um, and also, we almost forgot, uh, State FCCLA was last week, and we're going to send it to me to talk with the president and the team that's going to nationals. So, to you, Jack. Hello, everybody. I'm Jack Boza here with Madison Ho for president of the FCCLA chapter here at Hitchcock Tuller. Madison, how was State FCCLA? It was really good. I thought we did really well as a chapter. That's really good, really good. Um, uh, how did every not everybody do all around, but how did how did the weekend go? It went really well. Um, our parliamentary pr procedure team got to nationals. Some other groups got golds and then some silvers. That's good. That's good. Um, uh, and then, what was your favorite part of the whole trip? Um, probably getting to nationals, but also. Um, we went to the mall as a chapter, which was really fun. Good, good. Proud of you. Thank you. Hello, I'm Jack Bonza here with the Parley Pro team. Uh, so, where is Nationals this year, guys? Uh, it's in California, IA, in sunny San Diego. <laughs> it's my home place right there. That's right. Um, uh, what are you all looking forward to? I'm looking forward to golfing at Torrey Pines, and I hope John Daly is there to golf with us. I'm um, probably looking forward to uh, hustling pe San Diego people in uh, basketball on the courts. I want to see the ocean. That's not, I'm probably looking forward just to seeing such a big city and going swimming. That was mine. I'm excited to see the beach too. Excited to see the ocean and get a good Sunday. Thank you guys. Good luck to all of <laughs> you. Thank you, Jack. For that FCCLA He's interview a, stuff. He's a handsome devil. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> for sure. But anyways, I got birthdays. I love doing this part. So happy birthday to Christopher Hofer, Kiara Waldner, L Lillian Godfrey, Amy Waldner, Jedediah Martin Waldner, Jonah uh, Jonah Hofer, Thomas John Salmon, uh, Carla Schultz, Demarius Whip, and Kaylin Wirtz. So happy birthday, guys. And I have the upcoming events. So, um, Friday, today, is the school is in session, and then the FFA banquet is tonight, starting at 6.30. Um, and then... On Sunday, we leave for State FFA, and then Tuesday, or Mo Sunday, we leave for State FFA. Monday, we have uh, Junior High Track of Western Springs, Elementary Volleyball versus Miller, and then we're still at State FFA. And on Tuesday is the last day of State FFA in Brookings, and then there's also track in Escalina. And if you are an FFA member that is also in track, um, they should know, but Mr. Lenz is going to come get us some brookings yep. from there so we can go to the track. Oh, yeah. As always, folks, thank you for tuning in to another episode of HGTV Live. I am Ron Berry. And I am Brian Fantana. Stay classy, Hitchcock Tulare.